everybody. I'm James Cebulski. It is a pivotal game four tonight set to go down. Setters glide into position for the opening draw. This is what you play for. Moments like this, you can feel the energy in this building. And we are underway. Across the line and on the attack. Stoppage and play offside the call. Matthews is notorious for his shock and awe zone ability, which is his skill deeping to get into a scoring position and then put it away with a quick shot. Marcel's usually scouting before any D matchup because he's a special player and a good point getter. Those are two big names I'll be keeping tabs on all throughout this matchup. Now, sending it back upstairs. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Puck picked up by Lilgren. Pass to Nylander. Quick feed to Marner. To the low slot. New York's gained possession along the boards. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Takes a shot. Great save by Sansono. Line change. Centering pass. And that's stopped. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still scoreless in this one. The Islanders win the face off. Snapper from the stop. Oh, great club save by Sansono. By slashing the leather on this save, the shooter's in a great A scoring area, and man, he just whips out the glove and makes the save. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Oh, it stays out. He's got a piece of that one. Oh, another great save right there. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there. James, he was so dialed in, he tracked him perfectly. Goaltender very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low spot, and makes the save. New York's got the puck inside the offensive zone. And that doesn't reach the net. Taken by Romanov. Knocked away with the stick by Kent. Quick pass to Wallstrom. They've got the defense outnumbered. The Leafs have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. The Islanders are across the line and into the offensive end. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Receives the pass. Great heads up play in the neutral zone by Pichol. Denies him with the save. And we'll get a reset after the puck goes up and out of play. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Still looking for our first goal. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. Oh, you can feel that from up here. Some players get into the game by physically engaging early. There's a fine line there, but that was executed perfectly. The Leafs cross the line and gain the zone with the stop. Sliding up to the face-off toss here. New York's won the defensive zone draw. Here they come. Moves it to Marner. And now it's over to Nylander. New York's on the attack. Can't connect. How did he stop that one? He reads this play perfectly, James. He gets tight to the shooter. There's no room to put it by him. Got the puck after winning the defensive zone faceoff. The Leafs move it in. Fires it on net. Here's a shot. Oh, and he steps up, but 
have a glove to stop that one. Well, this is a really great save, James. I mean, you can see that he's battling for position. You can see him moving up and down as his eyes are trying to track and find the puck. That's outworking your opponent and finding a way to make the save. The Islanders move the puck in the defensive zone. Good use of the body on the play. And he's knocked off the puck there. Slides it back to the blue line. Oh, the minister of defense with the block. Scooped up along the wall by Gregor. Possession here in their own end. Feeds the puck to Riley. Passes on over to Domi. Super feed. Only comes up with a stop. New York's in transition. Moves it quickly over to Fashion. And that was on the player in front. Handles the puck. will glide into the dot. Horvath's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Here he is with the backhander. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Oh, what a hit along the wall. And that's a clean one, James. A great angle, shoulder to shoulder, and just laid it on thick. Makes his presence known on the ice. They go on the attack through center. Centering feed, and a new pass, another pass. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. Oh, I know what he was trying to do there, James. He thought he had it with that move, but he created some space for himself, but unfortunately loses the handle and it dies on his stick. Moves the puck over to Wallstrom. Here's a short pass to Matthews. Moves it to the middle. Picked off in front. Quick feed to Wallstrom. The Islanders carry it along the wall. Tosses it on to Matthews. New York's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Takes the shot. Answers it with an even better save. Slides it on over to Nylander. Right up the gut. Here they go. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Here in the later stages of this period, we're still scoreless. New York's won the faceoff at center. Quick pass to Holmstrom. Taken along the wall by Pulak. Handles the puck from the left side. Good defensive effort to poke it away. They've got some momentum here. Poked away in the offensive end. Picked up along the boards by Pulak. Brody's got it in the offensive zone. Takes that pass back at the point. Great read with the stick. Stops the rocket of a shot. The Islanders move to the offensive zone. Moves the puck along the half wall. And the puck leaves the offensive end. They'll be forced to do it over from center. Passes the puck over to Engvall. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. The Islanders get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Fires it, and there's the save. Quick pass across to Riley. And they send it right back to him. And that concludes the first 20 minutes of play. Second period action. Stick around.
fun environment for kids visiting long-term care patients. We are about ready to get underway here for the second period. Advantage goalies for the first 20 minutes. Let's see if we get a goal here in the second. Well, Cheryl, already a third of this one played. What do you make of this one? New York's been the better team here tonight, James, but they have nothing to show for it. That can be extremely frustrating. They'll need to start the second period with the same battle, the same compete. They'll need to manage the puck, and they just like they did in the first period. But they have to find a way to execute. It can't be scoreless if they want to win the game. Shuts them down. Stoppage in play as the puck goes up and over. We'll get a faceoff. Still plenty of time left in this frame. The game is still scoreless. Toronto's won the faceoff deep in their own end. Here they come up along the wing. The Islanders have it now. Angles it over to Nelson. Handles the pass. Here's the chance to set up now. Slip feed. Toronto's gained possession. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Tries to feed it over to Palmieri. The Leafs get a hold of it. Slides the puck ahead to Riley. And he takes the feed. Moves it to Nylander. The Islanders get a hold of the puck in their own end. Nice poke check. Quick cross ice pass to Matthews. And he slides it quickly to Lindgren. Denies him on the slobber. And down he goes as the puck goes free. And it's a quick pass to Thompson. He got all of that one. Tavares gains the zone. Shot. And he had the answer on that one. Oh, save of the play. Whoa. He's doing absolutely everything he can to keep his team in this game, James. Unbelievable save. Comfortable stretching your body, finding a way to make yourself as big as possible to get to the save. That's what he did, and that's why the save was made. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. The Islanders start with the puck in their own end. And he takes the dish. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Picking up some steam at center ice. The Islanders look to start the transition game. Feeds the puck to Lee. Oh, complete explosion on that physical hit. Four pass on the play, and the puck leaves the zone. Sends it into the offensive zone. Passes it over to Lee. Here's a short pass to Yarncroft. Boom! Wow, what a thunderous hit there. Wow, that was incredible. Everyone is on. Oh, had a chance to make a nice move, and the puck disagreed with him. Well, he's got such a slick set of hands. He's trying to manipulate his opponent one by one, but he tries one too many, James, and he loses the puck. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, we've still got zeros on the board. New York's won the faceoff. Looking to set up offensively. A serve And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Now a quick pass to Klingberg. The pass in front. He scores! What a play! Uh, the goaltender has no chance on this one as his teammate just makes a gift of a pass right into his wheelhouse and he just powders it by. Toronto's push here in the second is paying off as they now bleed by one. Well, you can certainly see the energy shift in the bench and the coaching staff talking to the team about continuing to push, keep the pedal to the metal here. While you have your opponent down, you got to attack. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. Toronto's got it against the boards. Dumps it into the Ozone. 
New York's looking to break out. Kane's the zone. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Toronto's looking to break out of their own end. Grabs the puck here in the neutral zone. Shot! Gets in the lane with the body. Looks to make a play over to Barzell. And that's snapped away in the defensive end by Lilgren. Slides the puck across to Nylander. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. A court blank! Denies them in close. The goaltender is very aware of where that puck is in that low slot area and defends his crease by getting out, being aggressive, and taking away any of the net. The Islanders need to find a way to convert on one of these scoring chances as they trail here in period number two. They win the faceoff here in their own end and take possession. Oh, he hammered him! Oh, he knew exactly what he was doing going into this along the boards, James. I love that it was a clean hit. He finishes it off perfectly. New York's got the puck against the boards. Horvath's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Battle along the wall. The Leafs gain possession along the wall. Shot! Oh, he saved it! What a stop! Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and send a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. And as play continues, listen to these fans. They're starting to get loud and recognizing what we saw not long ago here, Cheryl. Yeah, James, I mean, they're continuing to acknowledge the save he made earlier because they know the temperature of this game. And hey, the fans are now in it. They're all on board, and guess what? The goaltender knows it. Past the halfway mark of this period, 1-0 the score. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving. A reason why he can get square to it and make the save. Face off looming as both centers get into position. New York's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Oh, spectacular save right there. bone-crushing hits. Sent into the offensive zone. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Camp stick-handling in his own zone. Across the line from center. Jabs the puck away. Oh, he hammered him on the play. Oh, this is just a thunderous hit. Talk about physical engagement. He got all of them, James. <laughs> that was big time. And the puck skips away after that move. Well, he's showing off his skill set, trying to make a silky move around the defender, but he gets denied. And a good smack with the stick to get it down. The Islanders gain control of the puck. And the puck's kicked free. Takes the feed. Gives some nothing in front. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Beautiful saucer pass. Too many bodies in the way. Moves it quickly over to Nelson. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Riley. There's the horn, 40 minutes in the books. We'll get a refresh for both the players, Ice. Back with a third period next. Players are set, officials are set, third period action is coming up. They have dropped the puck here in the third. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. New York's been holding on to the puck a ton. They've been doing a real good job of protecting and shielding the puck, but it just hasn't translated into generation of offense. they got to continue to work on that through the third period. They are trailing, but it's right on them. You can feel it's on their stiff chains. It's just a matter of getting another one. They fight for it along the boards. Picked up.
up along the wall by Pellet. Denies him with the save. Knocks the puck loose. My word, they've really got them hemmed in here in their own zone. Slides the puck over. The Islanders have it from their own end. With possession along the wall. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Little Prince into the offensive zone now on the attack. And now he passes it to Lee. Wolfman's picking up steam. With authority. The Leafs have it against the wall. New York's got the puck in their own end. And now he moves it quickly to Lee. Down the left wing, they gain the zone. Lee's got it to the side. Getting a little physical there with that collision. Quick feed to McCabe. Rocked him. As a power forward in the game, you go north-south, and guess what? You deliver bone-crushing hits, just like that one. The Islanders have had more chances offensively, but they have not been able to convert trailing here in this third. New York's got a hold of the puck. Passes it to Holmstrom. The Islanders played along the wing. Lays the body. New York's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Look out! Big time save! Oh my goodness! Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. Such an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Toronto's ahead, 1-0. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Samsonov's been so impressive, in particular in that last sequence, James, and he is out of gas. It didn't prevent him from making that save, but now he's going to get some much-needed rest as that puck heads out of his zone. Toronto's moving it up the ice. Centering pass! Can't get the shot off. Hard hit, frees up the puck. Battling for it along the boards. And that'll free up the puck. Quick pass to Holmstrom. There's the whistle as the play was offside. Play set to resume with the face off ready to go. And after the draw to center, they've got a hold of the puck. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Sometimes when you lose the puck, it's a product of trying to do too much. Sometimes keeping it simple is more effective. Denies him on the one-timer. And he loses control here. Fantastic save. Samsonov's movements are outstanding. I mean, he gets to position so quick. He's athletic and he makes a huge save from the spot. on that screen in the video room on a goal, James. There's been a defensive error, and then you get caught covering up, and everyone gets caught out of position. As a result, it's in the back of your net. New York's got some fight in them tonight. Here we go, all tied up in the third. Yeah, these games are great, James, especially when they go back and forth right into the third period. But finally, they're taking advantage of the puck possession that they've had and cashing in on some opportunities. And that's offside, stopping the play. Marner's a playmaker and a good one at that, guys. He sees the ice so well, but it's his deceptive passing that can create chances for his squad. We call that his third eye zone ability, and it's how he contributes offensively. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. Brody's got the puck. New York's got control of it now from their own end. The Islanders take it across the blue line. Moves it to the middle. It scores! What an opportunity and delivers! Well, you know 
know he's worked a lot on this in practice because his hands are an extension of his body here, James. He knows how to manipulate his opponent. He dangles his way to the net, and he doesn't miss. The Islanders have gone in front at a critical time here in this one. It's a one-goal game here in the third. Well, it's exactly where they want to be, right? They have the lead, and they want to close this out. They're going to need to stay aggressive, stay on the puck, and not give any opportunities to their opponent. And he maintains possession of the puck here. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. The Islanders have been relentless in the offensive zone tonight, and they continue to lead in the third. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Handles it along the blue line. And he says no! Moves it to Martin. The Islanders have played it through the neutral zone. Pokes it away in his own end. getting it out of danger. New York's got it along the wall. Here he is in close. Tremendous athletic stop with the glove by Sensonov. What a save from point blank range. I mean, he's in fabulous position, square to the shooter in the slot. He makes the glove hand save. The Islanders continue to lead here in the third, listening to their coach's message. Lots of pucks on net. Handles the pass at center. Centering pass in front, and that's blocked in front. Moves the puck. Good read with the stick to break that up. Went for the dirty dangle, and it goes sideways. It almost looked as if he was going to get by the defender, but that extra move took his face away, and it goes the other way. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Sorokin. The goaltender's at the last line of defense for a reason, and this time, he bails his team out. Oh, and here's the pass. Of it to keep it out of the net. Who had the better night? Carlin, stand by. Marcel, the player, I think had the edge in tonight's matchup, guys. The deciding factor for me was the difference in points between the players we highlighted earlier. He obviously had more offense in tonight's game. The Leafs play it along the boards. New York's got control of the puck. Big save in front. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. Takes a shot, and he makes the save. Denies him again. Here in the late goings of the period, New York's got a 3-1 lead as they have dominated for the most part in this. Horvath's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. The Islanders ready to go on the attack. Nearing the final minute of the third. Here's a short pass to Thompson. Oh, what a save on the slapper! Moves it quickly over to Lee. Samsonov's got it, and the officials blow the play down. Well, this is a smart play. He's been dialed in all night, and he recognizes that he doesn't want his team to make any mistakes. The safe play sometimes is to hold on. Face off coming up here in the offensive zone. Well, they'll want to continue with the sustained pressure because the goaltender, he is fatigued. The Leafs looking against the half wall. 
Beautiful read in the defensive end by Thompson. And into the wide open cage, it's an empty net goal. Uh, and a sigh of relief as well, as it's a real insurance mark. You, you put it in the empty cage and you don't ice it, that's a good thing. Uh, the key to passing is also knowing the receiver, and he has an uncanny ability to know exactly who he's passing to in the wheelhouse, where they're played, and how they're going to get it off effectively. I mean, he's incredible when it comes to distribution. New York's offense has not been a problem tonight. They put a lot of shots on net and laid a big time late in this third period. And off the draw, they win the faceoff. The 360 with the puck. Made the stop on the play. Intensity will only continue to ramp up at the next playoff game, and we will see you all then here.